First of all, we start by creating a new project. Choose a folder and type the folder name that you wish the project to be stored on your computer. There is nothing in it because we are going to synchronize it for whatever we have on the internet, on our server. We go to Tools, Deployment, and we add a new FTP uh, server. We give it a name, any name. And then we should add uh, the details for our FTP server. Make sure you type your username and your password correctly. Test your FTP connection. Make sure the location uh, of the URL, the live location of the URL is correct. Choose your root path. By default is either www or public HTML. Go to the Mappings tab and add a slash. If you don't do this, um, the deployment or the download from the server will not work. Click OK. And now you're ready to download all the files from the server locally to your computer. After a while, the whole site will be transferred to your machine. Now let's add a database connection. You go to, uh, you choose Tools, Database, and then you see on the right side of the screen um, this tool window of the database. You add all the information for your database server. You test the connection. If it says that the driver is uh, missing, you install the drivers and you test the connection again. After a while, you will see this arrow and you will be able to browse the database tables from uh, inside uh, PHP Storm. That's it.